In this video, I'll be using PDQ deploy to package and deploy Sumatra PDF. I'm starting this video from my GitHub page, and that's because there are a few pieces of information here that I will be using for this video. And I will leave the URL in the description down below. Also, in the bottom of the page, you can find more of my videos that are related to this topic. For example, here you can find videos about my Windows Server setup, and there is also a video about my PDQ deploy setup. And now I will begin this video by downloading Sumatra PDF executable installation files, and for that I will use the link that I have here. That brings me to Sumatra PDF download page. I will be downloading the 64-bit installer. So I will click on the link right here. And then I will go to my downloads folder. I will right-click on the executable, select copy, and then I will go to my VMware workstation because here I have my Windows environment and here I will be placing the executable in a network share that is accessible to my users and computers. And for that I will open my file explorer and enter my file server name right here srv02 then i will go to my software share and here i will create another folder i will name it sumatra pdf i will go inside of it and i will place the executable here and now i can start creating my package and for that i will go to pdq deploy i will right click on packages then i will select a new package i will name the package sumatra pdf then I will click on steps, install. Here I need to provide my installation file, so I'll click on the button right here. Once again, I will go to my file server, SRV02, software share, Sumatra PDF folder, and select the executable. Also, we need to provide silent switches for this package, and for that I will go back to my GitHub page. And here I have all the silent switches that I will be using for this package, and I will click on the button right here to copy the values go back to pdq deploy and insert the values into this field and that's all that we need to do for this package so i will click on save and i will close the window and now i will be deploying this package to few of my clients so for that i will click on the package here then i will click on deploy deploy once then i will select my computers by clicking on choose target active directory and computers I will select my client 01 and client 02, then I will click on this button right here. The targets appeared in this window right here, and then I will click on OK and deploy. And now we need to wait a bit. And the deployment is over. We can see that it was successful for both of my clients, but I will double check by going to my client 01 that I have here. And here we have desktop shortcut for Sumatra PDF. I will double click on it. And it seems to be working just fine. And that's it for this video. Like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And see you in the next one.